Good evening, I'm Pia Antiveros. This is News.ph, but it's not politics as usual. As if we haven't had enough of pork. It's literally coming out of our ears, but we need to try and make some sense of it. Tonight, our guests are Congressman Amado Bagatsing of the 5th District of the City of Manila and Reynaldo Umali of the 2nd District of Oriental Mindoro. Good evening, Congressman Bagatsing and Congressman Umali. Good evening, Pia. Good evening, Pia. Thank you for being here, sir. Sirs, I mean. Uh, let's begin with this. Now, do you confirm these releases made to you as they're made to appear in the uh, Budget Department summary of PDAF releases for each fiscal year? So there's, we have here 2009, 2010, 2011, 2012. For you, Congressman Bagatsing, ang nakalista is for 2009, 35 million, 2010, 30 million, 2011, 70 million, and 2012, 70 million. Are you referring to, to our PDAF? Yes. Uh -oh. Yes, yeah, so these are the correct uh, figures. And for you, Congressman Umali, well, 2009, it was your brother Alfonso yes. who was Congressman. Well, he had 21.7 million. 2010, 29.8 million. 29.8 million. Uh -oh. I don't think so. You don't think so? Why? What was it? Well, uh, my, my PDAF, uh, well, my PDAF was uh, just half. Half. Uh, yeah. So it is uh, what probably about 35 35 oh, okay so nagkulang pa sila uh, 2011 70 million and 2012 55 million yes so these are the correct figures but um Congressman Bagatsing I just wanted to ask you know because uh base sa listahan na to yung 2011 2012 70 million while only half the amount for 2009 and 2012 can you, can you 2000 lahat yeah. naman yung 70 million a year and mm -hmm. lahat yan lahat kami uh, 70 a year, yeah. 35 first half, 35 second half, 30 uh -huh. million for soft, 40 million for infrastructure, what we call hard. Mm -hmm. Okay, and all this money went, uh, of course, in, in general, you're, you're going to say that this went to uh, legal uh, yeah, agencies concerned. Agencies definitely. concerned. Okay. In other words, although you know there, there is that general perception and unfair as you as you the congressmen uh, and congresswomen may think, there is that general perception because ang, ang congressman or even ang senator kumikita sa PDAF. Mm. Right. Hindi hu sa amin release ang mga pork barrel kung tawagin. Mm -hmm. Kami ho recommend lang sa uh, DBM. Mm -hmm. uh, sabihin namin, okay, itong uh, five million namin bigay nyo sa DSWD mm -hmm. para sa mga Seeds program ng DSWD, yung mm -hmm. mga indigents. O ito, 5 million, bigay uh -oh. nyo sa CHED para sa scholars namin. Uh -oh. o, ito naman sa, in other words, TESDA para sa skills uh -oh. so, training. So, dumindiretso dun sa agency? Sa ahensya. Sa ahensya. And they give it to an NGO or there are times na hindi NGO pero direct, direct ang sila na mismo ang nag... Well, depende sa agency. May mga agency miski na kaya nilang mag-isa. Eh, sa dami ng mga uh, siguro nagre-refer sa kanila, mm -hmm. meron silang mga accredited uh, NGOs, mm -hmm. accredited and licensed NGOs. It can also be the LGUs mm -hmm. and it can also be the uh, agency itself, no? Like uh, mm -hmm. pag infra more or less that is the PWH that will uh, implement it mm -hmm. more or less. Okay. Pero <coughs> hindi kayo, and when I say kayo, I mean uh, congressmen and congresswomen in general. Hindi kayo, and siyempre, kayo mismo, Congressman Umali and Congressman Bagatsing, hindi kayo kumikita doon. Definitely. Sa PDAF. Kahit pa paano, walang commission, walang, uh, eto, para 5% para kay Congressman, or walang walang ganon. Wala Abono ho kami. Abono? Abono. Hindi ho kami kumikita. Abono Aha. pa ho kami. Dahil kulang na kulang, lalo mm -hmm. na po yung social services. Mm -hmm. Okay. Is there such a thing as liquidating these releases? None, right? And that, that is uh, the technical term. Uh, yan yung uh, requirement, I guess, of uh, COA that you have to liquidate it. No? Mm -hmm. But uh, again, ang nagli-liquidate nito is the uh, implementing agency and, and or kung uh, NGO to, it is the NGO that will liquidate. Mm -hmm. uh, this to the agency concern, for example, uh, DSWD or uh, DNR or DA. Mm -hmm. And then these are submitted now to... Uh, <coughs> to uh, COA for the necessary uh, audit. Okay. And there is nothing in the law that requires that the congressmen or, or the lawmakers themselves will do the liquidation or will in any way account for where the funds went? You know, in the first place, Pia, hindi naman sa amin nagpunta ang pere. 
So how can we, li we liquidate something na hindi ka na gumastos? Mm -hmm. Dumaan nga yan sa ahensya. Ah, at yung ahensya yan, ginamit ang isang NGO. So yung NGO, magli-liquidate sa ahensya, let's say DSWD, and then yung DSWD, mm -hmm. mag-report -re sa main office ng COA. Mm -hmm. Okay. At no time did you feel that you needed to um, make sure about where the money goes? Not just to safeguard your... Uh, own uh, professional and personal integrity. Hindi naman, but, we have to be sure na binagasas sure. ng tama. Dahil, dahil pera ng yes, taong bayan yes, yan. Yes, yes, okay. yes. At best, you, uh, Pia, at best, uh, what we can do is uh, monitor mm -hmm. uh, and uh, make mm -hmm. sure that these monies are given to our beneficiaries within our respective districts. Mm -hmm. Okay. And you did bring those documents, Congressman Umali, because that what you're going correct. to prove, uh, try and prove at least tonight is that these, these, uh, this money went to the intended beneficiaries. Correct. Okay. Um, let, let's begin, uh, Congressman Bagat Singh, mm -hmm. with you know. Uh, according to this, uh, there is this inquirer uh, infographic uh, where you are listed as one of uh, 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 the lawmakers who has an exposure to uh, uh, the Napolis scam. So, quote unquote, an exposure to the Napolis scam 2006 to 2011. Let me, let me just put it up here. No? So, nandiyan po kayo. Mado Bagat Singh, Manila, nasa, 2010 nasa, to 2010. Nasa buntot ako. O, oh, nasa buntot kayo. Oh, nahiya ka, 1 million. 1 million. Okay. Nahiya, nahiya kayo. <laughs> nahiya kayo. Sa, anyway. sa laki po ng mga iba, nahihiya ako sa 1 million ko. Uh -huh. And then at the bottom kasi, ang nakalagay, source, documents, accompanying yes, whistleblowers, uh, affidavits. Now, uh, although it seems like a small amount, like you said, nakakaya. If you'll allow ano, me, Pia. Yes, please, uh, ano, please explain to us. I'd like to... Uh, Una, salamat. No? Hindi ka mo ako ng oportunidad ma-clear itong 1 million na ito. Uh -oh. Hawak ko ngayon ay uh, mga sulat na galing sa COA uh -huh. na pinako-confirm sa akin tungkol nga dyan sa isang million na yan <coughs> akin daw yung mga pirma at okay. kung alam ko yung project. Uh -oh. Kailan nila pinadala to sa inyo, uh -oh. sir? Uh, Ito, um, 2011, 2012. 2011. Pero, ah, so noon pa lang nag-investiga uh, uh, na sila. So, nung, so ito yung naging resulta. Yes. Okay. So, kung mga bak, pwede bang i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-i-
uh, were forged on these documents, these three documents of this Masaganang Foundation. W what are you trying to say? Una, una hindi ko kilala si Napoles. Mm -hmm. O pangalawa, wala akong pinirmahan na NGO. Yeah. Is hindi it ko possible? endorse ang Masaganang Ani. Okay. Is it possible, sir, that they just signed for you? Ganun na nga ang nangyari. They just signed for you and, and yet, with, with your uh, full knowledge and consent? No? Hindi pwede kasi no? pati yung beneficiaries, wala silang maibigay na listahan eh. Mm -hmm. At okay. lahat itong project na ito, mula nung ako yung maging congressman, may MOA kami. Mm -hmm. okay. Between let's say the agency concerned at a congressman at kung sino man ang NGO. Okay, so itong masaganang ani para sa magsasaka, etc. Wala kayong MOA dyan? Wala, wala akong wala. MOA. Una-una, ang akin na uh, pidap ay sa TLRC, mm -hmm. Technological Livelihood and Res uh, Resource Center. Okay. Biglang naging TRC ito. So, mm -hmm. hindi ko kausap yan eh. Yeah. Okay. Sir, when you said you got these documents, when? 2011, yeah, when, uh, 2012? Yeah, when the, the, the uh, uh, COA, COA was uh, verification. Yeah, they're going uh -huh. through a verification process. Uh -huh. At that time, when you saw this, did you, what, what did you do? Hinabol niyo na ba itong masaganang ani well, foundation? Did you file a case? Kinolect ko muna ng thoughts namin, <coughs> lahat ng documents namin, kasi 2007 ito eh. Mm -hmm. eh matagal na ito, six years ago. Oo. So, nagkakalap kami sa mga files namin okay. at wala nga ako makita ng mga ito, ito, mga dokumentong yan. No such, file, no so, such documents in your files? So, ang ko sa ngayon, nandiyan-dyan pa. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Sir, uh, if you don't mind, mm -hmm. Okay, so let's remove this one. Okay. okay, do you mind signing here? <laughs> Show us your signature. Ito na, ito na lang po para makapal. Then you can try, you know. Hindi ako sa ito mayroon ng hindi mo ka pirma dito, hindi mo ka pirma na katayo. Pero yun, dalawa na pinakita ko. Isa dito, tsaka isang 2013. Yan, 2007, 2013. At may mga mowa ako dito. Mm -hmm. ng lahat ng ahensyang kapartner ko na may mga pirma ko din. Okay. Le ahensya like which ones? UPPGH, mm -hmm. DSWD, mm -hmm. TESDA, okay. uh, Heart Center. Okay. Uh, Can we see the like, UPPGH? Many, many other congressmen and senators uh, give to UPPGH, hindi ba? Madami, madami. You do also, no? Congressman Umali. Oh, ito, example. You came prepared tonight. <laughs> uh, this is with the <coughs> training center TESDA. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. mga example. Yeah. Notarized pa ito. Not notarized. notarized. Pa ito. Okay. okay. 2009 ito. Oh, this is a requirement in, in the, uh, the release of PDAP. Because, MOAS. because ang magli-liquidate, yung NGO will have to liquidate with the implementing agency. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Kung wala kang mo, let's say, uh, yung implementing agency mag uh, li liquidate sila mismo, kung minsan hindi na kailangan ng mo. Uh -huh. Pero okay. patalasan may mo pa din. Okay. All right. Let, let's go first. Let's give uh, Congressman Umali. So, I'll, I'll take this down muna Sige, po, sir. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's give Congressman Umali a, a chance naman to uh, <clears throat> give his side. So, kay, kayo, kayo naman po, Congressman Umali. Sorry po. Yep. So, we have this... Uh, Page 24 to end to 25 of the 2011 Annual Audit Report of the National Agribusiness Corporation, DA Corp Corporate Subsidiary. So, ang sinasabi po rito, you, 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 your name was one of the six na binanggit. That is not NABCOR. I'm sorry, the uh, KMFI. 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 KMFI, yes. Okay. So, uh, ito naman, ipopost ko naman yung sa akin. What I have here is a, a list of all my beneficiaries, mm -hmm. numbering, uh, uh, I think, about 647. Mm -hmm. and beneficiaries in your district? In my district. Okay. Who, who and, actually uh, exist? <laughs> they yes, actually yes, exist. Yes. Huh? Oh. In fact, mm -hmm. uh, just to prove that, I have here the names, mm -hmm. the barangays, and even their contact numbers, and you can uh, very well check, and then the names mm -hmm. of the organizations, mm -hmm. and likewise, uh, the, the number of uh, uh, sprayers and fertilizers that I gave each uh, organization. So, mm -hmm. this is it. Uh, let, me, let me just post it. Oops. Okay, yeah. 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 And then, uh, what I can show also are pictures of these uh, uh, 
uh, awarding ceremonies that uh, we conducted uh, individually mm -hmm. and uh, and uh, some to the uh, president of the organization. Mm -hmm. And these are yeah. not just uh, uh, forgive me for it, saying these are not just parang photo opportunity na alika magpicture tayo dito hindi. Totoo. And, uh, totoo, totoo. and mm. uh, what I'm saying is that, uh, oops. Uh, you know, there are, there are many other uh, uh, instances that we gave up, but I was not there because of uh, mm -hmm. some, uh, some uh, previous commitment. So these are just some of those that I was uh, around at the time when you were distributing. Mm -hmm. Okay, but you did not give to this KMFI, one of those... No, uh, the KMFI is the conduit <coughs> because, again, uh, this, uh, how does this operate? Uh, DA will give it to, uh, to uh, an accredited NGO, mm -hmm. which is KMFI, and it is, again, DA which uh, accredited this. And then uh, uh, they act as the conduit, but mm -hmm. in my case, uh, I want to make sure that this really gets to my uh, constituents. constituents. So okay. uh, I have my own organization to assist because, uh, you know, KMFI is not from Indoro, and mm. they would not know who these people are. So uh, I have my own uh, organization yeah. within uh, my district that uh, oh. assist. And so uh, another NGO. Uh, what is it? Either NGO or mm -hmm. staff. My 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 uh, district staff. Uh -huh, okay. Uh, Parang lumalabas wala kayong tiwala dun sa KMFI or <clears throat> gusto lang yun talaga manigurado na talagang makakarating yung pera? Well, uh, I guess it's all about coordination. Uh, mm -hmm. You know, they must coordinate with us because uh, how can this reach my constituents if, uh, if uh, they do not even uh, know where it is and they do not know where, uh, mm -hmm. where uh, my constituents are. At kailangan and we distributed, oh. the, 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 we distributed the, this in seven towns, huh? mm -hmm. in seven towns within my district. Yeah. There was no way that the money uh, or, or the... What was this? A fertilizer, no? Yes. Could reach your constituents kung hindi siya dumaan ng KMFI? Yes, because the MOA was between DA and the KMFI. There, there's, so in other words, hindi pwede ang DA diretso doon sa constituents niyo? I, I couldn't because, uh, you know, I, you know if, if this happens, then uh, I might have some problems because... Uh, um, uh, this uh, organization that I'm handling, uh, the, the president of uh, mm -hmm. this is my 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 wife, mm -hmm. and uh, and uh, the manager is my son, mm -hmm. so it couldn't be uh, them that will receive directly from me. Incidentally, mm -hmm. this is not my pida. Mm -hmm. This is a uh, lump sum appropriation of the aid that uh, I availed of uh, on top of, of uh, on top my, of the PDAF. Yeah. Okay. So okay. these are uh, availed of by other representatives. So why shouldn't I? Mm -hmm. Okay. You have other documents, sir, regarding this uh, particular case. Well, this is about <coughs> it. Uh, ju I just want to uh, uh, to emphasize that uh, I have here the phone, the contact mm -hmm. number, so that. Uh, if there is anyone who would like to uh, check, then uh, they can very well... Uh, mm -hmm. uh, okay. Yung sinasabi po na there's a balance, uh, a 10 million, uh, meron, meron pang balance na 39 million kabuan, tapos may 10 million para under your name, at uh, only 15% has been released. Ah, Everything has is, been released. No, this is 10 million, <coughs> and uh, what was released was only 1.5 million. So mm -hmm. that is what I distributed. Okay, and then, ah, that was what was released by DA to this yes. MFI. Oh. And that is what we uh, dis, uh, distributed to our beneficiaries. Uh -huh. Did you and ask what happened to the 8.5? It's still with DA. I just got a letter from, uh, Kong, uh, from Secretary Alcala that... Uh, the only amount that was released for this project, for this particular project, is uh, 1.5 million. Mm -hmm. well, do you have that letter with you now? No? I'm not sure, but uh, I can uh, send it to you. Oh, well, when was that letter given to you? And I think this one? was uh, September 2 uh, when we received it. Just, September uh, 2? Just yeah, just the other day. Mm, okay. Mm. September 2, Monday. And then yesterday he has that press con. Yes, yes. Naming the, you as one of the... Well, I don't deny because uh, I really received it, uh, and uh, what uh, that, that press con said that uh, I was given 1.5 yeah. million only. Uh oh, what does that mean? Kung ang 8.5 enasa DA papala? 
Ano ibig sabihin nun? Bakit ganun? No, that is the, the well, the circular of COA and or uh, the MOA uh, says that uh, uh, there is only uh, the mobilization fee that will be released initially and then mm -hmm. subject to liquidation and that is between, again, NGO and the uh, DA. Okay. Then they will release depending on uh, what was uh, being liquidated. Okay. Uh, Congressman Umali and Congressman Bagatsi, we'll just have to take a short break. Uh, News out PH, we'll be right back. Uh, stay with us. We have a lot more to talk about. Welcome back. You're still watching News.ph on the Solar News Channel. I'm Pio Antiveros. Our guests tonight, Congressman Amado Bagatsi and Congressman uh, Ray Umali. Congressman Umali, you have a copy of a COA Commission on Audit uh, Circular. Yes, it's a that's 2008 correct. circular, and this is about uh, the rules, no, for <coughs> guidelines in the granting, utilization, accounting, and auditing of the funds released to non-government organizations mm -hmm. or people's organizations. Mm -hmm. So, uh, in this particular, uh, uh, well, uh, the import of this particular document yeah. is that uh, releases to NGOs are allowed. Mm -hmm. So, uh, implementation of uh, projects by NGOs are allowed. Mm -hmm. And uh, the requirement is, uh, let me just go through this, oh. uh, the government organization shall identify the priority projects. Mm -hmm. For each project proposal, the government organization shall accredit the NGO PO project partners <coughs> Mm -hmm. And then, uh, so it is the responsibility of the implementing agency to accredit. Of course, when you accredit, you first do a background check, make correct. sure that it's not bogus. To and it uh, exists uh, mm -hmm. in the address given. Okay. And okay. then the MOA, of course. The MOA. Okay. Okay. Uh, Congressman Magazine, let's talk about this lucky LML marketing. On page 55, the core report, your name appears beside mm -hmm. that lucky LML marketing, unclaimed out 25.1 million, etc. What is that in about? the first place, uh, Pia, as I told you earlier, hindi kami tumatanggap ng pera. Mm -hmm. yes. So, ang ahensya. <clears throat> oh, pero lumalabas kasi sa COA re uh, news report na galing sa COA na meron daw akong unliquidated na 20 million mm -hmm. pesos, DSWD. Mm -hmm. I just got a certification yesterday from Secretary Suleiman. Oh. Humingi kayo sa kanya? Oo. Oh, kasi, okay. eh, iniipit na kayo. Uh, no? oh. <laughs> ito sabi ni Dinky Suleiman, as of calendar year 2008, up to 2000. Let's put it up here, sir. Yeah. <laughs> okay. 2008 calendar year to 2012. Mm -hmm. Ang unliquidated ay 2,250,000. Mm -hmm. And not and the okay. And di pa Itong 2.2 I covered ng 1 2 3 4 NGOs. Mhm. Mm uh, 700,000 sa Caritas Microfinance, uh, Red Cross for Blood, mm -hmm. Kabaka Foundation 700,000, and Hospital ng Manila for 500,000. Mm -hmm. Itong tatlong ito, nag-liquidate na sila sa COA. Mm -hmm. okay. So, liquidated na yan. Kaya lang, okay. bine-verify ng COA, <coughs> DSWD, yung report ng liquidation. Mm -hmm. So, pero liquidated na yan. Ang yeah. talagang hindi liquidated, since 2008, ay hospital ng Maynila. Mm -hmm. So, binigay ko yung pera sa, sa DSWD. Ang DSWD, sinabi ko, bigyan mo naman ng pondo yung hospital ko. Mm -hmm. So, yun okay. ang binigay sa hospital ng Maynila. So, bakit ako mag-liquidate ng hospital ng Maynila? Hindi ko naman ginastos. Oo, oo, oo. So, ang dapat okay. mag-liquidate, ang hospital ng Maynila sa DSWD. Yeah. Okay. And of course, ang, ang ibig sabihin ng liquidation is that the agency will present receipts yes. as to where Sino the money mga, went. Saan ginamit yung oo. pera? Okay. So, ito lahat, so, sa sabi ni Secretary Suleiman, 2.250 mm -hmm. uh, from calendar year 2008 to 2012, liquidated ang 1.750 rito. Mm -hmm. So, ang naiiwan na lang ay 500,000 mm -hmm. na yun ngang sa hospital ng Maynila na lamang. Pero mm -hmm. hindi ako dapat mag-liquidate. Hindi ba kayo ang dapat mag-follow up dun sa agency kung saan napunta yung PDAF nyo na, oy, mag-liquidate nga kayo, make sure na... Tabaho nga ng uh, DSWD yun because... Kailangan mag-report sila sa okay. COA. At hindi trabaho ng congressman yun? Ang trabaho, ng trabaho namin, bigay yung pondo sa kanila Oo. at uh, mag-refer ng mga beneficiaries. Ay, bakit pa kasi ang... <laughs> anyway, okay. Uh, congressman Umali, yung Philippine Forest Corporation naman has been in the news lately. Tapos, 
you are reported to have given 15 million of your port to Phil Forrest. Correct. Is that correct? That's correct. Correct. Oh, okay. Uh, that's, uh, I would uh, admit that. Mm -hmm. Ang, uh, ang issue naman dito is uh, sinasabi nila, <coughs> yung NGO which is uh, MLFI is a bogus NGO. Mm -hmm. But uh, ito, I will show you an Sige po. We'll audit know. observation memo okay. issued by COA. And ito ho. Dated June 26, 2013. Dated June 26, 2013. And okay. uh, sinabi nila dito, sa lahat ng mga NGOs na binalidate nila, only... Itonami and ito yung MLFI. MLFI were confirmed to be existing in the address validated. So, okay. ibig sabihin, existing oh. yan. Kompleto yung mga... Oo. Oh, oh. Eh, so, bakit ngayon? Okay. <laughs> yung okay. nga, hindi ko pero, maging yan. Ba't naging, oh. uh, naging bogus yan? Oo. Oh, oh. Pero, uh, Janet Lim na po is NGO. No, this is... No, different. not MLFI. Not, not, okay. Not, not. And wala, then, wala pala kayong, either of you, wala kayong pera sa isang Janet Lim na Poles uh, NGO. Meron ako, yung, Meron yung, yung, yung first, na lang. No? Yun lang. Uh, pero yun lang, this is na. not PIDA. Yun yung sinasabi ko. Yung appropriation. Sorry. Uh, it came from, uh, this is a department. Department. Uh, uh, lump sum appropriation okay. that okay. Uh, I was able to avail uh, Ako PIA, wala. Okay. Wala, wala. Wala, tanda. Hindi ko kilala talaga yun. Eh. <laughs> okay. Ako, Sige po. Uh, ako, I will not deny. I knew uh, Janet Lim Napole since 2001. Oh, okay. How did you meet her? Uh, I was chief of staff of uh, my brother, si Governor Boy, mm -hmm. former congressman, uh, whom I succeeded. And uh, I met her through uh, her lawyer, who is also a Baden graduate. Uh, who? Si uh, Freddy Villamor, Tony mm -hmm. Villamor. You so, met her while your brother was congressman or governor? Yes, was uh, congressman. Yes, but we okay. never had any dealings with uh, uh -oh. Napoleon. You met her where? In Congress? Where did you meet ah, her? Hindi, siguro outside ito. Because uh, it was... Uh, but it was a simple acquaintance, you know. Uh, uh -huh. uh, he, uh, she had a lawyer and uh, this lawyer was known to me. So you, you had a meeting or you just bumped into each other? We bumped into each other. Bumped into each yeah. other. In but uh, my brother nor myself had no dealings on any of our PDAF with uh, Janet. Why not? Were you well, staying away from her, or did, had you already heard about her? I mean, no, was she already no. a famous name in in, in uh, the halls of the Batas? I Manzo? couldn't recall that, uh, uh -huh. but uh, I, I don't think uh, because this was uh, in 2001. Yeah, okay. This was uh, a long time ago, but. Okay. Uh, At wala naman kayong picture, <laughs> kasi mami ami magsisirculate na. Uh, I also <laughs> did not uh, attend any of her yung mga functions, no? so what wala nga. So once lang kayo nagkita, nag nag meet, yun, yun lang yun. Ah, uh, I, I couldn't recall. Pero siguro meron pang ibang instances because uh, you know si yung si Freddie Villamor could have been my partner when we formed the law firm uh, in 1998, but hindi kami natuloy. Ah, so okay. I'm quite close to the lawyer. <coughs> yeah. mm, anyway, okay. so ito yun yung issue. Again, uh, this money. Uh, went to a lot of uh, people because uh, kaming magkapatid no? as mm -hmm. our legacy program to uh, to Mindoro uh, mm -hmm. we we uh, launch and we call it the UTOL no? magkapatid uh -huh. unified tree of life, life program mm -hmm. and uh, we intend to plant 12 million trees mm -hmm. 12 million 12,000 12 trees to mm -hmm. coincide with the date mm -hmm. of the launching okay. and we had uh, a series of uh, uh, activities uh, where we did, you know, ito, kita mo, then you, then yung, mm -hmm. uh, yung lands, no? And so we planted, etc., etc. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, this is even, you know, this is even, <coughs> uh, uh, you know, I have a whole set of uh, pictures with all of the beneficiaries that uh, mm -hmm. uh, are receiving all of this uh, Funds uh, uh, <coughs> through uh, through the uh, Maharlikang Lipi Foundation. So mm -hmm. okay. our programs are well documented, fully implemented, mm -hmm. and uh, this really goes okay. to our constituents. Of course, you're a lawyer. Of course. Congressman <laughs> Bagasing, are you a lawyer? No. No. Okay. Next, dapat pala abogado niya si Congressman. Anyway, sige po, we'll, 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 okay. we'll take our seats. Um, okay, let's just wrap this up. No, so. Uh, you, you've been, well, a congressman Bagatsin, you've been congressman for quite a while. You're actually a comeback in congressman. This is your second or third term? This is my last term. Your last term. On my oh. second cycle. Second cycle. <laughs> well, I'm on my sixth term. 
Oh, oh, sixth term. So, and then kayo naman po, Congressman Umali, this, this is your is second, second term. term. Second term, no? Mm -hmm. uh, like you said kanina, you just took your your brother's place. Pero, ano ba talaga yung, kumbaga yung nakaugalian ng uh, mga congressman pagdating sa PDAF? Well, para sa amin, uh, Pia, yung lapitan ka ng mga constituents mo, lalong-lalo mm -hmm. na yung mga mahihirap, na dialysis, cancer patient, <coughs> uh, uh, mga diagnostic, uh, gusto mag-aral, uh, napakalaking ginhawa na matulungan namin ang amin ng mga mahihirap, mga marginalized na kababayan. Kaya nakalulungkot na meron siguro maliit na porsyento na nagbibigay ng kahihiyan sa pork barrel at lahat kaming mga talaga naman nagbibigay ng tulong sa mga mahihirap, <coughs> puputulin ngayon. Mm -hmm. Sa amin mga congressman, <coughs> wala kami magagawa. Pero nalulungkot kami dahil ito mga mahihirap, wala nang tatakbuhan. Sasabihin nila takbo sa LGU. E di ang haba ng pila, mm -hmm. yung lahat ng congressman ng Maynila, na ngayon ay bawat distrito, lahat pupunta kayo sa isang lugar, mm -hmm. City Hall. Lahat ng nasa NCR na congressman, wala nang kwan, uh, PIDAP, pupunta lahat sa DSWD. Mm -hmm. isang daan, bawat isang congressman, sa NCR lang, 3,500 na tao ang pipila araw-araw. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Kaya ba ng ahensyang tugunan yun? Okay, good point. Congressman Mani? <coughs> well, my uh, take on this uh, uh, PIDAP ano, is that uh, para sa akin, uh, as I mentioned earlier, this is the great equalizer. Kasi, alam mo, dito siguro sa Metro Manila, baka yon iba yung pangangailangan lab. But in our case, in the rural areas, uh, this is more needed and this is more felt. Ano? Uh, lalo na yung island province like Mindoro, napakalungkot uh, kung, kung yung mga congressmen, lalo't sa malalayong lugar. You know, uh, uh, makikipagbakbakan kami, lalo na kung neophyte ka. Ako, in the 15th Congress, I was a neophyte congressman. And uh, mahirap makipagbakbakan kung, mm -hmm. kung uh, walang pidap. No? Mm -hmm. But uh, why did I say it's a, a great uh, equalizer? Because each and every congressional district gets annually 70 million. Mm -hmm. And uh, mm -hmm. for the full term of three years, each and every district gets 210 million. Mm -hmm. And uh, kung wala ito at uh, wala yung mga congressman at kanya-kanya ito, eh kung ako'y uh, neophyte congressman, baka hindi ako maka, kahit piso, hindi ako makakuha. Dahil siyempre, yung mas magagaling, mas matatanda, mas batikan na congressman, yeah. silang makakakuha nito. Kawawa naman yung, uh, mm -hmm. yung uh, mga okay. distrito na hindi mabibigyan. So, Para sa akin na, uh, you know, sabi nga ni uh, Kong Amado na uh, kawawa naman yung mga kababayan namin if they will be deprived of this PIDAP mm -hmm. uh, simply because uh, a few or uh, a small percentage uh, of this uh, fund uh, goes astray. No? Mm -hmm. and, okay. uh, and ibig sabihin yung nagamit ng hindi tama. Mm -hmm. Pero for us uh, uh, na... Nakita nyo naman, as we showed you, na nakita nyo, ang dami-dami naming beneficiaries. Mm -hmm. Lahat umaasa sa amin, papano na sila. Mm -hmm. Kung maabolish yung PDAF, tatakbo pa ba kayo? Ako? <laughs> May dead air bigla. Hindi, ako naman eh, miski na gusto ko tumakbo, miski walang mm -hmm. PDAF, hindi na ako pwede. pwede. Oh. Last term na ako eh. Okay, pero pwede sa 2016. Uh, well, uh, 2019. Kaila, kailangan talaga ma-distinguish ng mga botante. Kasi yeah. ang problema, Pia... Yeah. Sir, sorry, we, we don't have much time. So, please answer the question. Kung wala nang PDAF, tatakbo pa ba kayo? So, 2019? Well, uh, Yes or no? Kung hindi makakatulong, huwag na. Huwag na. Okay. Congressman Mali? I will. Uh, because, uh, you know, I have learned so much. <coughs> I have uh, had uh, enough experience for me to be able to uh, get funds even without PDAF mm -hmm. okay. through uh, the regular uh, line agencies. And uh, I will just have to... Uh, exercise uh, diligence in uh, okay. in pushing for my uh, projects to be funded by uh, line item budgets. Okay, so we need to say thank you, but I need I have two short questions, very brief questions. Congressman Bagatsing, hindi po ba kayo yung uh, uh, 
Were you, weren't you the same congressman who figured in that paper bag controversy? Do you remember that? Nung panahon oh, ni Gloria Arroyo? Pero yung, yung mga paper bag oh. ngayon, yun yung mga sinasabi ko nung araw nga na masyado naman malicious. Oh, oh. In the same manner na ngayon, malicious, malicious na naman. Malicious na naman to. Okay. Oh, oh. And Congressman Umali, kayo po yung, you, of course, you, you, were, you made a name uh, during the impeachment trial of Renato small Coron lady. as a prosecutor. Sm yes. Si small lady, mm -hmm. kayo yon. Yung small lady yung nagbigay daw ng uh, dokumento Documents. sa deposit ng dollar account Ay, ni Congress bank, bank ni, ni Corona. Anyway, okay, my last question is, uh, Miriam today was saying that if, if or, or when charges are filed, Senators congressmen will go straight to jail uh, because this is non-bailable. Are you ready to go to jail? Why will I go to jail? I did not commit a crime. Mm -hmm. Okay, and Congressman Umali? Same here. Uh, yeah. as, as we have shown, uh, we have uh, done our jobs. Mm -hmm. We have given all the benefits that we could uh, take from national government to our constituents. So, uh, uh, where is the where is the crime? Mm -hmm. Okay. So we have to wrap up now, because <laughs> over time na tayo. Maraming salamat po, Congressman. Let rest assured, Pia, na my father who served for many many long years as mayor and congressman, hindi kami na sa sa katawilian. Mm -hmm. So, asahan ng mga kababayan kung hindi po tayo gagawa ng katawalian na kahihiya po ninyo. Okay, thank you, sir. And Congressman Umali, thank you very much. Well, uh, ganun din kami. No? My father was governor uh, for a long time in Mindoro. We have kept our name uh, clean uh, for the longest time and we intend to uh, uh, mm -hmm. preserve that. Maraming salamat to our guests uh, tonight, Congressman Ray Umali and Congressman Amado Bakatsi. And thank you for watching. I'm Pia Ontiveros. This is News.ph. See you again next Wednesday. Good night.